meteorologist Brooke Foster is standing by live. It seems like winter is in the air, Brooke. Right, it is uh, definitely that time of year where we're starting to see some snowfall. However, we're just dealing with rain this morning in Kalispell and Missoula. It is cold enough to support snow in southwest Montana, but you, you are free and clear of those showers. However, we do have some slick spots on our roadways this morning in southwest Montana. Uh, 191 south of Bozeman, areas of ice and black ice being reported all the way to West Yellowstone. And on 15 north uh, up towards Boulder Hill, you're going to run into some areas of scattered snow and ice. Same goes around the Georgetown Lake area. It is a soggy start, though. Missoula to Kalispell, we've been dodging showers. We picked up a tenth to a quarter of an inch of rain area-wide yesterday, so all of our roads are wet. But since midnight, a few hundredths of an inch of rain has dropped in northwest and west central Montana. We're tracking more showers today. This is right around 2 o'clock, Mission Valley, Sealy Swan, Missoula, and along the I-90 corridor, a little bit of wet weather, valley rain and mountain snow. That's what we're going to see at around 6 to 7 o'clock. So even if you're waking up this morning without any showers, pack the rain gear. We've got some wet weather for that evening drive around the Mission Valley. Even the Missoula and Bitterroot Valley could see a few more showers. As far as snow goes, mountain passes could see a couple inches of snow accumulate as we move throughout the day. Speaking of snow, you'll see a passing snow shower or two tonight in the Butte-Bozeman area. And that could set the stage for a slick start to your Wednesday. Overall, though, second half of the week, high pressure is going to build. And that's going to allow for us to see sunshine and some warmer temperatures. Now, with the threat of a little more precipitation today, you may want to stay alert to changing weather conditions. To get a live look at that radar, all you have to do is download our NBC Montana weather app by searching NBC Montana in your app store. Today's forecast, Thompson Falls, Superior, Pulse, and Clinton, Dillon, 46 degrees. We'll be at 48 in Ennis and Libby. Mostly cloudy to cloudy skies, showers at times. Uh, winds will be breezy, gusting up to around 20, even 30 miles per hour. Our higher gust will be along the Rocky Mountain front and in central Montana. That's where we could see wind gusts in excess of 40. Tonight, temperatures dropping just below the freezing mark with 28 in Polson and Thompson Falls. 32 for you in Clinton. We'll be at 24 this evening in Ennis. Again, southwest Montana wet roadways could be a bit slick for you early tomorrow morning. 10-day forecast for Kalispell. Temperatures right around 40 degrees as we make our way through the end of the week and the first half of your weekend. You climb above normal on Sunday with a high of 45. Temperatures will be in the 40s through next week. Mainly expecting dry skies all the way through the weekend, but by next Wednesday, we could see another round of rain. For Missoula, 10-day forecast, we're in the mid-40s, so near normal through the end of the week with a mix of sun and clouds. Patchy fog will be a concern area-wide during the second half of the week. That's what's going to impact your morning commute, and with overnight lows dropping into the 20s, that could be some freezing fog. Making plans this weekend, there will be some cloud cover, otherwise looking good with a high of 50. Come Sunday for Butte, your 10-day forecast. 40s to end the week with sunshine for your Wednesday and Thursday. Increasing clouds as we head into your Friday and Saturday. Temperatures will be in the low 40s on Saturday, hitting 48 on Sunday, 50 for you by Monday. For Bozeman, your 10-day forecast. A little breezy today with temperatures making their way to 50. You'll be in the mid-40s, so near normal Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Overnight lows will be chilly, dropping to 20 degrees for you Thursday and Friday morning. During that time, there could be some low clouds and patchy fog. This weekend, mix of sun and clouds. Highs right around 50 for you Sunday. Shower chances few and far between, but we do have a slight chance of maybe a shower or two moving in for you Friday afternoon into your Saturday morning. Looks like people need to slow down uh, on the mornings, you know, later this week, Brooke. Right, during the morning hours, that's when we could see some slick spots. I mean, we have them out there this morning. Uh, mountain passes starting to uh, kind of see some scattered snow and slush and ice. But southwest Montana roadways on 191, really from uh, Norris Hill all the way to West Yellowstone, black ice is reported this morning. Okay, so already getting slick. All right, thank you so much, Brooke. And with that, you want to download our NBC Montana news and weather apps so that we can get you uh, severe weather and traffic alerts wherever you are. Well, coming up, flames broke out at a popular Butte barbecue, and we're finding out how this emergency could have been a lot worse. This now is a live look at some beautiful morning skies. 